Hey guys, so this video is going to be just super detailed regarding the white strips deal. That one has so many questions. I have so many new followers. A lot of you have mentioned you are newbies, so like their terminology is not being um, understood. And I forget sometimes that some of you guys are newbies, so I just talk as if you guys understand me so i apologize about that but this video is going literally step by step and if i forget anything i try to like catch all the questions and comments that i got in the last video in this one and answer them but if i missed anything definitely let, let me know um i just wanted to make this video to make it easier on you guys because during the week i'm super busy so sometimes i don't get back to you guys as fast as i would like so Hopefully you guys don't have to reach out to me and this video just answers a lot of your questions. I also want to let you guys all know that we did reach 2,000 subscribers. We are continuously climbing, um, so I'm super excited about that. I just posted the giveaway deal yesterday, which is linked here in this video. It's super easy. You just have to comment on my last video regarding some directions. So watch that video. It'll tell you exactly what to do to enter the $20 giveaway. Um, but since we already hit 2,000 um, subscribers and that was like my goal and it's only been not even 24 hours since I posted that video, I want to give you guys a couple more days to be able to watch it and realize that I'm doing a giveaway and then to be able to answer because if I do it now, it's kind of unfair to a lot of people that have been supporting me that just, just haven't gotten um, around to watch the video and know I'm doing anything. So I'll give it a couple more days, but I'll definitely let you guys know. I'll post a video doing the actual giveaway itself. And actually, before I jump into the deals, I want to say one more thing. So sometimes your cashiers will not allow you to do certain deals for whatever reason. Cashiers have the ability to say no to really anything. Um, so if you get turned down, totally up to you if you wanna try another store. I say keep doing it because I know this deal is working. We have receipts everywhere um, showing that this deal actually works, that all the coupons apply, all however many of them they are. Um, so definitely just do what you need to do if you don't feel like trying two different stores after you got turned down at the other one, don't. It's okay. There's a will be another deal. But if you're going to get it, if you're going to go after it, then kill it because this is an amazing deal. But let's stop talking. Let me get into the deals and answer some questions for you guys. Okay, guys. So this is what I came up with here. It's a lot more visual. The breakdowns are clear um, for all my visual learners. This will be easier for you guys to follow along. First off, I'm going to go ahead and tell you which coupons you need as well as some meanings um, because I have a lot of newbies because you guys have commented telling me you guys are newbies. Um, so some of the terminology you haven't understood or you just have questions about. So the first coupon, which is down here, it says $15 off with card. These are all going to be digital coupons, which are in your Walgreens app. But that first one is what I keep saying is an IVC. So IVC stands for instant value coupon. The instant value coupon is going to be a store coupon and those apply to all the products in your transaction that qualify. Next, we have our 30% off of 30. Some accounts did not receive this one. So um, if you don't have it, unfortunately, this deal isn't going to work exactly like mine. If you can't find any, I would recommend typing in multi-brand or 30 in your search in the coupon section. That is how a lot of people have found this coupon. Third one is going to be a $10 off of one. You might only have one, but in this scenario, we are using two different ones. They're going to have two different pictures, but they both apply to these products. So we have a 10 off of one and then another separate 10 off of one. Last coupon is going to be a five off of one. These three right here are all manufacturer coupons. So those are the five things you need to have clipped in your app for this scenario to work as I'm explaining it. So $87.98 for all three products and we get $87.98 because these are buy two, get one free. So $43.99 for the first one, $43.99 for the second one and zero for the last one because that's our free product. So $87.98, we bring it down here and we're going to apply $30 off of the $87.98. 
a lot of you asked, why did you take off $30? This coupon right here, the IVC, like I mentioned, it takes off, in this example, $15 off of each product. It's going to take $15 off of this one and then $15 off of that one. It does not take anything off of this one because we didn't pay anything for it. So that's where my $15 comes. So 15 and 15 equals 30 minus $30. So the reason that I did this one before the 30% off is because the 30% off doesn't calculate until store coupons are taken off. So $87.98 minus $30 is $57.98. So 57.98 times 0.3, which is our 30% off, is $17.39. So we're subtracting these here. Next, we go to the $10 off of one coupon. We have minus 10, we go to the other $10 off of one. Here it is. Guys, this is something I'm gonna explain again, you need two of them. If you only have one manufacturer coupon that's $10 off of one, it is not going to apply two times. These are completely different coupons and you need to clip both of them. If you only have one, which a lot of people do, your out of pocket will be $25 and something cents. Um, so you're essentially gonna be paying five, about $5 after you get coupons, and after the points come back. But anyways, back to our scenario. $10 off here, another $10 off here, and then $5 off of the last one. Three manufacturer coupons, but we only paid for two products. People have been saying the third one is not gonna apply because Walgreens has a policy that you don't use a coupon on a third item. What's going on here is essentially a glitch. So the system's having a glitch where it's actually applying all three of the manufacturer coupons to each one. So 10, 10, and five. If you do not want to do a glitch, go ahead and take this one off. And then one's going to apply here. The 10 going to apply here. And that one is taken off. Totally up to you how you want to do it. You're only losing $5. So if you want to do it that way, no problem at all. So now we have our total of $15 and something cents. I don't know why I have the cents directly on me. But after that, you're still going to get $10 back in points because we hit the threshold on the sale with a crest that spend ooh, 20 or 30. I'll jot it down um, and get 10,000 points back. So that's the whole scenario guys buy two get one free all these digital coupons ten dollars back after our out of pocket i did see some comments that said that they used points to lower their out of pocket um if you want to do that that's that's fine I guess if I were doing the deal, I would stay on the safe side and not use points because the out-of-pocket is like $15. Um, so it's not insanely high for me, but if you can't do that and you want to maybe take a risk, because I'm not sure exactly how the points are going to adjust with the 30% off. So that's why I'm staying on the safe side and saying don't use points. But if you feel confident that you know this deal will work if you use points, go for it. I have had confirmation in my comments that it is working and still giving back the $10 in points even if you use points to pay. So that's it, guys. Let me know again if you have any questions. I've been trying to answer them. I have tons of them. This is the first video that you guys have so many questions. Um, so I'm trying to stay on top of it. And kind of help you guys out so let me know hopefully this cleared up a lot of questions um this one is probably the one i had the most questions about the ivc and where i got 30 dollars from any ivc that you use at walgreens if you have three products and there's an ivc that takes three dollars off of one it's going to apply three dollars off of one of all three products you don't have to keep scanning it it's just going to scan one time IVCs in the booklet are multi-use, so you just need to have one booklet and you can use it all month. IVCs in your app will go away after the first use. So once you use this one in this scenario, it's going to go away. But again, you can use it again if you get the ad, which is in the store once you walk in. 
All right, guys, so that's it. I think I covered most of the questions, if not all, that I saw in my comments. If I missed it, yeah, as well. Comment, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks for watching, and thanks for support. Um, giveaway is going to continue for a little bit, like I mentioned, and I'll let you guys know as soon as I am going to go ahead and make that final call on a winner.